This is the Apex solo generator switch. And I ran the Apex last night with the 150 watt solar generator. And I drained the Apex down to zero power. Not zero voltage. We'll see later on when the power comes on, but it should come on, but I drained it. And this went out completely, but now it's being powered by the Kodiak. There's, there's the plug. So the Kodiak is powering this 150 watt heater now. And the time is 6.52 and I went to sleep at 10 o'clock and the temperature in the van is 68 degrees which is comfortable. 72 would have been a little better but I'll take 68 it's very comfortable I don't feel any chill air especially with the uh, hot air coming off the, the heater it's a 150 watt heater so when um, when the solar power comes up the sun comes up and I get solar power into the Apex solar generator then we will see what voltage does the Apex power management and turn off the solar generator it didn't drain the battery to zero power we'll see what power what no it drained the solar power to zero power as we see it, but it did not drain it to zero voltage. And we'll see what that voltage is when the sun begins to come up. So I'm going back to sleep and I'm going to run it on the Kodiak. So good night. It's 7.10 in the morning. The sun is just beginning to rise above the horizon. And the apex knows that the sun is coming. Because that's the, that's the blue light saying solar energy is hitting the solar panels and power is coming into the apex <laughs> but uh, is it enough is it enough to fire up the apex a little so I turned the switch on to DC, switches on DC, switches on DC, and the panel is not lit up yet. So not enough power is coming in to light the display. So I, I drained, I did a perfect job of draining the the apex to zero power. It's eight o'clock in the morning and this is what zero power looks like. Zero power nine point four three volts zero watts coming in and it's um It's still, still the sun somewhere low in the horizon 
and there's clouds now. Those are clouds. Can't really see it in the camera's clouds, but they're clouds. They're clouds. And uh, it's being hit by some solar enough to light up the enough to light up the display and uh, the blue light is brighter it is brighter than it was before so some power is coming into the apex so we'll see how it charges up today from a uh, totally discharged to um, it's now reading 9.40 volts. Still zero power and zero watts. So we'll see how it goes. I stepped outside the van. And so there is a sun. It is above the horizon. And it's... Uh, clouds around. And I got trees all around me, which is fine with me. I mean, I'm going to be moving a little bit. Never stay too long where you slept at night. So I will be putting the van in the sun to start charging well. It's about 8.30 in the morning. And the apex is beginning to get a little power it says one percent in charging 40 watts is coming to it and it's a uh, 9.91 volt so it's happening slowly charging we'll see how it goes it is cloudy today it's a uh, 236 and it's 84 percent charged 60 watts coming into the battery it's 11.95 it's very cloudy out there so it's doing it's doing well it'll be um it'll be 100 percent power but it may not be at 12.57 like i like it so um uh, i'm pleased with it so it's charging up it's supposed to be a sun up here but I don't see it anywhere. So not the best efficiency, but still able to charge the Apex. I'm grateful for that. We'll have to see how close we get to 100. I think we'll actually hit 100. I just don't think we'll hit 12.57. We'll hit something less than that. It's 4 o'clock. And... It's a 91% power with 12.1 and absolutely no sun. Just, there's no, oh, there's the sun. Not a very good sun. So, I don't know, 91% four o'clock. Sun behind barrier. When I came out, there was no sun. When I turned around, there was a sun. Don't know how much it'll charge up. It's uh, 5.30. And cloudy outside. I'm trying to get... Uh, focal point to get the uh, display on it's 93 percent up 4 watts and 12.16 volts just too cloudy there we go too cloudy not gonna get anything more just too dark so that's the best it's going to do tonight.